Epidural injections are very, very common today. The goal with an epidural is to place a medication in the, quote, epidural space, which is right next to the spine where the nerves are exiting. It's most commonly, you'll hear about it, would be in labor patients, in labor and delivery, because we put a little local anesthetic in the epidural space. Five minutes later, the, you know, the patients are best friends because the pain from labor goes away. In pain management, the goal is, instead of putting local anesthetic in the epidural space, is to put a small amount of steroid or an anti-inflammatory in the epidural space, trying to reduce the swelling around a nerve root that is being compressed. Epidurals are used for a degenerative disc disease or typical sciatica where the nerve is being compressed. Uh, we put a little bit of steroid around the nerve root. Within three to seven days, the pain usually reduces or completely goes away. Lumbar disc disease that compresses an exiting nerve root and therefore causes sciatica, or referring the pain down a leg or down an arm, uh, is a very common uh, presenting symptom to our pain practice. If the nerve is being compressed a little bit or just being touched, the patient usually will come in just for pain. But if it gets squeezed even tighter, they may present with numbness or even tighter, they could have weakness or paralysis. Obviously, paralysis is an, you know, more of an emergency. We want it to be aggressive on that one. But all three situations could be helped with an epidural by reducing the swelling, almost decompressing the nerve. So instead of having surgery, we can decompress it with an anti-inflammatory and still get the same good results without having to go to surgery. A very common question is asking how fast an epidural works. Uh, in labor and delivery, it works in five minutes because it's a local anesthetic. In pain management, because I'm putting a steroid in there, the steroid is gonna reduce the inflammation, but it takes time. The average person, probably about three days to start working, and we still wait and see what the peak resolution of the pain is over the week. So I'm, some patients will get resolution right away as they leave uh, over the next morning. But I truly ask everybody to wait three to seven days and see what the end result is.